Real quick guys, before we start this video, finally got up the next video on the family channel, so the link will be down below if you guys are not subscribed to the family channel. Go over, check that out. Really more laid back, home renovations, uh, stuff Allie does behind the scenes, that kind of stuff. Uh, so just posted a new video on that channel, and also Banks Built just posted their new video uh, from this Monday, so both links will be down below to go check out those videos after this one. What is going on today guys? Welcome back. Michael and I are just, you know, in the shop, doing shop things working on this race truck trying to get this thing done but we have been working on it for the last couple days and we have made some more progress and today today is a monumental day in my opinion because today is the day as you can see we have got some springs on our shocks we are officially coming off jack stand jimmies today they uh so-called chassis table also known as our jack stands that were here keeping us completely level today is the last day that we are going to be on those because we are going on the ground on the suspension and we are going to steer this thing and hopefully if the rain holds off we are going to push this thing outside we are going to do some flintstone power right here and we're getting this thing rolling moving it is going to look somewhat like a complete truck today which is insanely exciting you know, the small victory battles that we talk about today is going to be a, a big day, in my opinion, because it has been sitting, it's been sitting in this exact same space for a decent amount of time. A decent amount of time, let's put it that way. So, a couple things uh, just going over, catching you guys up. Again, I told you I wasn't going to try and kill you with all of the details every single day, but as you can see, we have got our front wishbone. Uh, it's not completely welded in, but it is uh, set in place, tacked well enough to keep the axle front axle happy and centered as we are going to be moving around. And then I'm waiting for you to interject here at some point, otherwise I'm just gonna keep ripping. But we're going to swap places with the Dragster and uh, the Pro Street truck, and we are going to put this thing up on the lift because Michael has just, just you know, he's just had it laying on the floor welding. So if we get it up on the lift, we can then uh, weld some stuff underneath the wishbone, uh, some of the reinforcements that uh, Kyle from Rustic Nail made us for the back here. Uh, we can do that on the rack. We can do it much easier. So uh, without further ado, the big day is here. What do we have to do? We need to put springs on, take it off the jack seats. Hmm, okay, sounds sounds easy enough. So uh, we got this one set in there, but we need to redo something, right? We got we got something in the wrong yeah, spot or? I put the, there's spring bearings. Spring bearings go down here. I just put them up there, just, you know. You know just, just getting excited, you know, it's a big day. So we've got these bearings here. And what do those allow it to do? They allow the, the... So you can adjust, this is a spanner down here. So you can adjust the spanner a little easier. Should, it should spin easy with tension on the springs. Mm. Gotcha. So we got to complete the front and then the back ones. We just have to kind of move the suspension and bolt them up, bolt them up. Yeah, just the bottom mounting bolt should take care of it. Guys, this is a big day. This is a big day. I'm going to put up on the screen right here. I can't remember how long ago we, you know, we started in the center of the shop right there and we cut it all apart even more than it already was. But you know what? Today, I just, I'm... I'm excited. I, I am. I am excited. We're gonna put the doors on it, and really, I mean, we got to remount the front clip. But if this front clip was on and it was outside, I mean, we're we're looking like a truck. We're looking like a truck. But anyway. I'll stop rambling and uh, we can uh, we can get to work. Uh, before uh, we do that, uh, I did say in this video, I feel like my hair is just, my hair is floating out to the side. I feel like I'm yeah, I feel like I'm you. I'm like I'm, no, I'm not gonna get a haircut. You have to get a haircut first. <laughs> We're in a hair off right now. Okay, me and Michael have both not cut our hair, even though some would argue that point. We both haven't cut our hair here. We're seeing who's gonna crack first. But anyway. Um, <clears throat> I told you guys we would have a winner for the PJ trailer. Uh, we did actually reach out to the winner. They are in the process of filling out some paperwork. So I don't really have that for you in this video, unfortunately, but that is coming. So uh, we have reached out to the person though. We're waiting for them to get back to us. So anyway, 
Uh, what else do I have for you? As always, guys, Banks, uh, our friends over at Banks put out a new video uh, yesterday, the day before. They always put out their videos on Mondays. Make sure you guys go check that out. And uh, yeah, the rain, hopefully, is going to hold off. And we are going to get some more work done on the Pro Street truck. And then one, once it's up on the lift, I can show you guys a little bit more of the front wishbone that we spent the last day or so working on. It came out really, really nicely. So... Yeah, here we go. Look at it. Would you just look at it? Oh my goodness. What a beautiful sight. She's gonna get a suntan. Oh man. Well, she better get a suntan before she gets a bath because it looks like it's gonna start to rain any second here. Oh man. Oh man. Whew. Maybe this isn't maybe this isn't a big dramatic moment for everybody else watching, but I mean so I did look. I did. Look, I did. I did look up Instagram. Instagram. We we cut. Yeah, I got so many thoughts running through my high, my mind right now. I'm I'm, I'm a little lost. But uh, what else is new? Three months ago is when we cut the front end off. But man, it's been apart since. Well, it's not. It's not all the way back together yet. But you know, this is what, what's that saying? One small leap for uh, man. One one giant leap for mankind. Is that is that more correct? Hey, if you hop in it, I'll push you to McDonald's and go through the drive-through. What do you want to do? You want to uh, push it out the way? Oh, driveway time? All right. Let's do that. Yeah, let's park them next to each other. Whew, I'm out of breath. Whatever you'd like to do. <laughs> Put her in gear, Jimmy. <laughs> how'd, she, how'd she feel when I was pushing you? Did she feel fast? Oh, nice. Faster you know what? <laughs> we got a slight squeak in the front end. We might need to look at that. Seals. Seals? I'd, uh, I'd say she's quite a bit lower. I don't know, what do you think, like six inches? 
It's very, it's really hard to tell on camera. I'd say it's ever been. Yeah, it's really low. Looks really low and quite a bit shorter. You can't really tell until you park next to it, though. Because the lower it was going to look longer, right? Yeah. I'm so glad we shortened up the bed. Like, I'm so happy. Oh, yeah. You know what it looks like? A million bucks. A million bucks, baby. <laughs> All right, should we go get the front clip? Yeah. You think we should put a dummy it on? We got to dummy it on. Hopefully it doesn't blow away in the wind, but. All right, we're gonna go get the front clip. All right, well, before it starts storming, you know that I had to uh, get the doors on there. We had to put the front clip on there just so you guys can see uh, see exactly what it looks like. Oh, hey, Jimmy, you didn't tell me you needed my hand. I didn't know you were that ready. Oh my gosh, the wind is just destroying everything right now. Push. Woo, just cleared. That's a big girl. That's a, that's a long booty you got there. <laughs> but just wanted to give you guys uh, a look with the doors and the front clip on. Uh, the front clip will be next to kind of get mounted up. And once that's mounted up, we will have a... Uh, Pretty much almost a complete rolling chassis. Uh, I don't know, the wind is really picking up, but here you guys go. Just the look, oh man. Oh, it's so exciting to see. Woo! All right, we should, we should probably push it back in before all heck breaks loose. We sheltered the storm. The vehicles are back inside. No one got rained on. No one got uh, blown away. Michael's been sitting over here on his uh, on his telephone here, and uh, he just showed me something that I think is uh, very noteworthy. To uh... Greg has this like thing about like he wants an RV. He wants a he wants a Peterbilt. He wants a race car. He wants a race stacker trailer. We've got a lot of things to bring to all these places. You know, we found the answer. No, you found the answer. This guy found, <laughs> this, the, this guy found the answer. Take a look at this. Oh, he got the car hauler front end. He's got a car in the back, a razor. He's got well, he's got two cars, a razor, the sleeper on the Peterbilt, and then the RV. That man. <laughs> got to give that a heart. Got to give that a heart. Well, and then and then in some in some states he can probably tow something even behind the RV. A boat. A boat. Nah, <laughs> yep, a boat. That's what he's missing. <laughs> uh, all right. Well, what a day! What a day! Do you want to? Do you want to? You want to? You want to at least like put it up on the lift and give it give a little peek underneath there. Uh, yeah. Peek underneath. Well, well, good. I wasn't gonna go there, but uh, you know, I guess <laughs> too late for that. Dirty Mike coming out. <laughs> Feels pretty solid. All righty, ladies and gentlemen, here she is, belly of the beast. You guys can see a little bit here on the wishbone set up in the front. Obviously not done, but well enough to move around and be tacked. Michael himself said that it's the most beautiful thing he's ever seen in the world. So uh, looks good. We were thinking about putting it going towards the front. But are you uh, you happy that we uh, we made it to the back? 
think so. Looks good. I like this, it. This pan will be a lot sh uh, what, shallower. Yeah. Um, so again, mock-up engine, not the real engine. We're running a dry sump pan on the uh, new engine, which will be pretty much like... I'd say right about there, maybe even a little bit higher. So we'll have even more clearance than uh, Clarence knows what to do with. But <laughs> you, yeah, you didn't laugh. You didn't laugh at that one. Yeah. Cool. Good story. <laughs> but here she is. What a day. What a what a great day. Oh boy. Just look underneath here. Lots of stuff to still weld underneath here. Michael's not going to have to crawl on his back anymore. Just look at the look at the money shot right here. Just look at the money shot. Super cool. What a day. What a day. Lots of work still left to be had, but we've been dreaming about this day for quite a while. Off the jack stands, able to be moved. You, you look like you're examining a patient that's about to go under undergo some major surgery. You're just like, mm hmm, I see things I didn't see before. I'm getting my hands clean. <laughs> Be able to work on our trans mount much nicer underneath here. So we're gonna use this location right here for our transmission mount, make another bar that comes across here, probably make it removable, but we'll attach to uh, attach to this plate back here. Oh yeah, oh yeah, gotta get some stuff painted up, get some stuff grinded out. Mmm, getting there, getting there. Anyway guys, that is going to wrap up this video Honestly, we're actually cutting the video kind of short uh, because we are uh, headed on a road trip. Road trip, me and Silent Mike. I'm not taking, this is my, did, did my last solo road trip last time. We're, we're taking Silent Mike with us um, and you guys can guess where we're headed. Uh, first, first trip with the new Diamond C. What could we? Are you tired? I was gonna say, are you yawning? Are you, are you yawning already? <laughs> my goodness, you better go home and get some sleep. My goodness, but anyway guys, Road trip tomorrow. Take your guesses down below. What are we picking up? First load on the new Diamond C. Actually, two. Actually, two. Double duty. I forgot. We're picking up two things. Ooh, ooh. You just gave it away. Oh, you just... My goodness. I, I'm telling you guys to guess, and he just tells you the exact location where we're going. <laughs> so, we're picking up two things on this road trip. So, again, 44 foot diamond C coming in clutch because we're gonna need more room than the PJ uh, was going to give us. But anyway, that's gonna do it. Hit the like button before you leave, subscribe if you haven't already. See you in the next video on the road. Let's hope we don't get lost or anything else. Anyway, see ya, see ya, bye. What? Or ice storm or uh, anything. All right, see ya.